And finally from China, with the country facing a declining population, the government is trying to incentivize marriages. However, divorce rates have hit a record high, up by a whopping 75 percent from almost a decade ago. And despite divorce being socially frowned upon in Chinese society, business is actually booming. Entrepreneurs are making big bucks from the high separation rates by offering couples a chance to destroy any evidence of their marriage. Our final report offers all the salacious details. Once upon a time, wedding photos were sacred symbols of eternal love, hung proudly on walls, shimmering with the promise of forever. But forever, it turns out, can be quite short. And now, a quirky business is cashing in on the aftermath of shattered hearts, thanks to China's record high divorce rates. Enter Liu Wei, the self-proclaimed love story morgue operator. He's not your typical matchmaker, in fact, quite the opposite. In 2022, Liu launched a peculiar venture, a factory that turns wedding photos and love memorabilia into confetti. But his business is no laughing matter. As divorce rates soar, Liu's company is thriving. Between 2000 and 2020, divorce rates in China surged from 1.2 million to over 4 million annually. Panicked about the nation's shrinking population, the government imposed a mandatory 30-day cooling-off period in 2021 to curb impulsive separations. Though it worked, sort of. Divorce rates fell below 3 million a year, but marriages are still on the decline. That's where Chinese entrepreneurs like Liu have come in. Liu's customers ship these oversized symbols of romance to his factory. There, his team gets to work. First, they spray paint over the faces, erasing all traces of the once happy couple. Then the photos are fed into industrial shredders and ripped apart like forgotten promises. But wait, there's more. Liu's crew doesn't stop at the pictures, they smash the glass frames with sledgehammers, turning them into glittering fragments of shattered memories. The best part? It's all filmed. Clients receive a personalized destruction video, often set to an upbeat soundtrack for a surprisingly joyous twist. Once everything is shredded and smashed, the remnants are whisked off to a waste-to-energy facility, transforming these relics of love into biofuel. So, while China wrestles with its shrinking birth rate and fewer marriages, Liu Wei's love story morgue continues to thrive. It's a strange, almost poetic business, offering a cathartic end to what was once seen as a timeless commitment. In a country where both partnerships are rapidly evolving, businesses around divorce are booming.